history in Uganda. Like Peter Tosh said, he doesn't know what marijuana is. Marijuana is a bird from Cuba. I think that's what he used to say. It is herb, you know, cannabis. Cannabis is as old as time, even in this region. As old as time. Animals were given herb. What is new in this country that came out of, which is recent, is the smoking of it. Are you aware that in Jamaica, for instance, there are being given stuff for like elders who have never, don't even know how to roll a spliff? No clue. They don't smoke it. They don't, they don't use it for that. Because to them, smoking the herb is to waste it. You're burning it. Not only are you burning it, you're burning your lungs. There are a thousand other ways of, of using a, a herb, cannabis. A thousand. The world is realizing this now. Making medicine, making cars, making ropes. Sheep, sheep ropes, very strong. They come from hemp for years, thousands of years. So the reason why it was made illegal, for instance, is because even cloth, the strongest, the, strongest, the strongest come from hemp. But the Americans had cotton and their slaves, a lot of cotton. So they decided to fight hemp at the time. But Indians, you know how Rastafari started smoking marijuana? If you go to India, the sadhus, those guys with the long, who never cut their hair, never wear clothes or whatever, one of their spiritual tenements, they smoke when they are, in fact in India they don't arrest it, they are allowed to smoke. It is part of their, if you go to the Amazon, those uh, Native American, you know, uh, they use herb. Or other herbs, they've used them, you know, when they're in a state of prayer. We never use that here. It is said that in Jamaica it was Lord Howell, you know, Pinnacle Hill. He had all his huge farm of guns. He learned it from the Hindus, their spiritual whatever. Uh, the, the sadhus, that's, that's what it said. That's, how, that's when they started smoking. He, brought, he borrowed that from Hinduism. Even, even the word ja, it is said, it was because when the Hindus were chanting, they were saying jai, 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 when they were praying. It is said that's, how, that, that's where Leonard Howell got it, you know, the ja. It wasn't from Jehovah. That's what he said. All these things. If you go to Jamaica, you'll hear all these things. So, but here in Uganda, it is normal. If you, if you go to a convent right now, of, of, of Christian convent, the nuns, and what, they have marijuana. They feed it to the... It, is, it has been here for years. The smoking of it. Now, if you go to where Nyabingi comes from, like in the hills, if you go to the Batwa or whatever, those people, they used to smoke tobacco. Not cigarettes. Tobacco. Even, you know, even Bunyoro. Smoking tobacco in Buganda was, did not exist. That's what I'm told. Not even now spirituality. That came from Bunyoro, smoking the pipe. People, when they were sad, then started, you know, started smoking. You know, when they lost somebody, then the, the, the pipe, that's how the pipe entered. Our car. It was never, there was no smoking here. It came from Kitara, but not marijuana. The marijuana, the, 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 the cannabis. In the hills, if you go to the Ronzori, some of them, but it was mainly tobacco. I'm thinking the smoking of marijuana and spliff and that, reggae music. Period. Tobacco, not cigarettes. That is a staple. Has been a staple around Nalubari in er many areas, but not in the central here. That that came in maybe 400 years, 500 years ago. But even our spiritual whatever did not smoke the pipe. If you go to our spiritual, you know, judge so on, judge, there's no smoking. Not even alcohol in many of them. So marijuana, I'm thinking the smoking came from reggae music in Uganda. But the growing of it and the plant, no, it has been here for as long as time. But it wasn't smoked. It was used to feed, to heal animals, to heal human beings, to heal birds. To this day, you can feed. They use marijuana. Well, let me hear you say mountain.